good day friends I've got a project for you I'm gonna make this project in a couple pieces so the movies will be split up uh, let's start with create new design and this is gonna be another print in place car so let's make sure we name it I'm gonna put PIP for print in place car MDH and I had been building these uh, laying on their side but it ends up being hard on my head so I am changing it and building it flat I'm going to start with the box, and then I like to make this box uh, 30 wide, and I like to make it 60 long. So I'm building my card this way, and then a real cool thing I like to add is I like to use the Sweet Radius tool, and I'm going to put a number 4 so that instead of a square shape, the body of my car is a little more rounded, which makes it look a little more cool. Uh, you can change your steps. Uh, to make it even more smooth, see what you like. Uh, I'm going to stay with 20. And then, of course, the length, width, and height I already stretched the other way. I am going to stay with 20 high for my car. So remember, my car was 60 by 30 by 20. All right, with our car body in place, let's add the wheels so that way we can prepare for the wheel wells. I want you to go down to the featured shape generators and I want you to find the extremely cool meta capsule. When you bring that little fella out, I want you to change his measurements to 12 and 12. And then what's super, super cool is you can take the bow and make it outward and it turns into a sweet looking wheel. Next step, of course, would be to make that. Uh, black so it looks more like a tire and then I think it would look extra cool if we cut out a hubcap so let's quickly go back to our basic shapes and grab a cylinder that's a hole and remember it's 12 plus the bow so let's change this to uh, 8 And then I recommend that we only sink it in two millimeters. So I'm going to raise it up three millimeters. And uh, when I sink it flush, then if I go up one, two, and then I'm going to orbit above, use the very cool fit to selection uh, view from the top, grab them both, align them, pop, pop. And now I've got a hubcap when I group my tire takes a second for it to cut it out but there you can see that looks pretty darn nifty with our wheels built head to the next training movie to learn how we're going to take care of our wheel wells where the wheels are going to go